Welcome to another episode of Waffle TV. I've got the cast and crew of As Is. Tell us a bit about it. What is it? What is um, the play? It's it's. Uh, it was one of the first plays about the AIDS crisis. It was premiered in 1985 off Broadway. So this is its 30th anniversary. Year. Um, and it's really it's a love story set yeah. against the backdrop of the AIDS crisis. <laughs> dark <laughs> it's dark but it's funny yeah. as well i think there are lots of things within it that everybody can relate to like love fear of our own mortality yeah. <laughs> crisis and yeah. we've got to the main cast uh, yeah. welcome to edinburgh guys how's nice. it going yeah. loving it yeah. Yeah. <laughs> how's the preparations for play going so far oh yeah it's been, it's been going really well um yeah we've had we've had some pretty pretty good houses so far uh, really good review from the list and yeah, great feedback. Yeah, no, we've had you know any hiccups have been ironed out and nipped yeah. in the bud straight exactly. away. Exactly, it's been really Hit enjoyable. Hit the ground running. Yeah, yeah. Really, really So, what type of message do you want people to take away from the play at the end of it? Because it is, it's emotional. Yeah. It's the eighties developing age. Well, it's yeah, a real, you, you real said, event. You said it was dark. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure that it that it is dark. It's um, I mean, it's it's about obviously a dark problem. But it's but all but everyone in it is, is I mean they're they're very fleshed out, full, yeah. fully rounded human beings that really just want to live and love and, and be happy and, and get as much out of like was in, in my character's case how much time he has left. Um, yeah, I, I mean it's, it's actually hello. <laughs> <laughs> Got some intruders. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Go anywhere in Edinburgh. I know. Yeah. <laughs> We've had a lot of streakers on stage as well. Yeah. 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 See you afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> Back to the message that we want yeah, people okay. to take away. Um, from, from my point of view, I play uh, Sol, who is uh, the the lover of Rich, who's diagnosed with HIV at the top of the play. Um, from my point of view, it's, it's quite intense. It's quite um, it's quite neurotic. I think the whole way through it, uh, dealing with someone that, that you really care about, uh, like you, it's, it's almost your world in a way. Having something that you know, watching them die in front of you every day actually is Powerful. obviously yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, we were really fortunate to have met a guy recently uh, called Michael. We met at Waverley Care, which is an Edinburgh HIV AIDS and Hep C charity. See, yeah, right, yeah. yeah. and uh, <laughs> local, yeah. Uh, and uh, there, he was he was wonderful, and he spoke to me about. Um, about losing his partner to AIDS in, in the early 90s, late 80s. Uh, and to hear someone talking about it like that was amazing. This kind of stoicism that you kind of develop from doing stuff like that as well. So that was really helpful for me as a character. Uh, really. Get your head around it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, but the, the, the theme, I think when, you, when you've worked on something intensely enough and you feel like the relationship with the characters and, and it's in the script beautifully, um, you realise that the, the kind of, the, the, you know, love conquers all or whatever, yeah, yeah. it doesn't matter whether they're arguing, what's happened in the past, uh, that, you know, standing by each other is really important and that's a really nice message in any story, I think. Yeah. And I think for me as well, there's, um, there's still now, even 30 years on, there's still a lot of stigma attached oh, to an HIV totally. diagnosis. Um, and it's not something people really like to talk about. So I think this play sort of demonstrates that what, whatever's happening in your life, you know, there is support available, yeah. there is care available. And um, you know, the thing that really struck me researching with this play was Waverly Care's play that they think there are uh, that twenty five percent of the people with HIV in Scotland don't know their status. So what we're really hoping is that people will come and see the show. Yeah, get the topic of conversation going. Yeah, and maybe they won't be so frightened or feel the stigma so much and yeah. will go and get themselves tested. We're working with Bioshore as well, who do the HIV self-testing kits, which is really interesting for Scotland as well because it's such a, you know, it's such a yeah. sort of big country with lots of isolated communities. So that could be a really um, easy way to find out your status. So that's what we're hoping for. Okay. Well, that's it. You heard it here, as is. Thank you guys very much. Thank you. Thank you. And break leg. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers.